Hi. Room service. Mm -hmm. Let's see what it looks like. There's That's your pizza. My pizza. Cheese pizza. I just washed it, worry. <laughs> I look for like a meat on it for a minute. Yeah, it looks good. Hot. Mm. It's your flounder. It looks good. Look at that cauliflower, yummy. Gosh, it smells good. You smell that? It smells real good. Mmm, the artichoke Ooh. dip with melted cheese on top. That is hilarious that they it's would like a put a piece cheese. of American cheese on there. <laughs> I, I don't think you really necessarily use um, American cheese for on any other than baking and stuff. Or... It's actually good on broccoli. Ooh, brie. Yum, yum, cheese yum. Cheese plate. plate. That's delicious. How nice. Cool. I did take... That probably took over an hour. Yeah, but it's good. We had time yeah, to, we shower to shower and, and everything. get ready. Totally get ready. Now we're ready. Let's eat. Yes. Well, here we are again. We've showered and left the room, had our room service. Amy's over there at the Starbucks bar. <laughs> and I just wanted to say real quick, candidly, without her being here, I just want to tell you guys about her. She really is the sweetest sister in the whole world. Um, she's just really kind and giving, unlike me. She, even if she wants something, she'll give it to you. If she doesn't want to do something, she'll do it. She strives to please other people especially me I sometimes take advantage of that and I'm not the nicest to her as I could be maybe but she's always so sweet and I love her so much and I don't know what I'd ever do without her love you Amy where'd your donut go Amy back on the plate and in the trash <laughs> she tried it first and said she didn't like it and she's like we'll try it to make sure and I smelled it and it smelled like a roll so I took a bite of it and I spit it back out on the plate. It literally tastes like a roll fried in fair grease. So here's the island. I think this is one of the last tenders back. We're getting ready to go. Let's see what time it is. Oh yeah, they leave in 20 minutes. They already sounded their horn, I guess, telling anyone I'm stuck on the island. You better hurry. We're leaving. So wonderful. I'm so happy. I know. I truly am. Oh, I'm so relaxed, Amy, aren't you? Ew. That's one thing I was going to say is that, you know, before we went on the cruise, I was like, oh, we're going to be crazy and have fun. And I was thinking like, you know, well, we always do that. But no, I meant like I was thinking more crazy, would. like party and stuff. But then I get here and I'm like, you know what? I don't want to drink. I don't want to go party in the pool with everyone. I just want to sit here and be lazy. I don't get to do that ever. I'm just going to sit here and just relax. Oh, yeah. And I can feel it. Can't you? Okay. Just that serenity that you feel in your mind when you're sitting yes. here and knowing you have no responsibilities, no stress, no yes, worries. nothing to worry about. Nothing whatsoever. on your mind, yes. I don't have to make dinner, I don't have no to... No invoices to send, no have to open questions. The fridge and get no water kids, out. right. <laughs> no arguing because they didn't get their thing. Even or, when the kids are good, they're always... I you mean, know, yeah, kids argue, good yeah. Kids. But you know, there's still issues to deal with. Yeah. You know, and Your stuff. mom not calling you all the time. So for having... Four days with not dealing with anything but just being here and uh, having and being served and your food ready at all times. That right there Hello, is a perfect to vacation. Drink for you folks? Oh, um, not right this minute. Thank you, though. It's just what I needed. It's On top of all that, you get the best views in the world. Yeah, this is amazing. You get to swim and just. View. Oh, I love it. It was We're so fun today. Away from Coco Key in about 20 minutes. We're gonna be heading to Nassau. Uh, We're gonna be there tomorrow afternoon around noon and it doesn't leave until 11.59 p.m. We're going on a walking adventure still, right? Yes, that's the plan. Yay. And um, I'm just super excited because we grew up going on to Holland America. Well, grew up, we've already grown up, but that's our first recruit in Holland America. And they were just so luxurious, relaxing, and, and they also had nice places to sit. They had a crow's nest where you could just look out. I would just look out when you're driving in the ocean, just watch the water. And I missed that on the Glory, which is the first cruise I'd gone on in like over 10 years. And so I was kind of disappointed in the relaxation department, but we, we did some great short excursions. And I'm still iffy about the third I day. I, I want to stay on the ship. This is my relaxation ship, that's what I'm calling it. And if I ever just need relaxing, I'm coming to the Enchantment of the I about the third day. I still want to stay on the ship because I haven't even feel like I've done enough on the ship. There we go. Right. Yeah, we're having a little dilemma, just so but you know. But also, looking at that again, the water was the coolest, but it was only like this high. Like up to your thighs. I really wanted to like just swim, like in water, you know what I'm saying? You mean swim in an ocean? Yeah. So, I know tell them about this place. But I also want to stay on the ship. I don't know, I'm torn. I don't know what to do. Well, you know, we always try to do a healthy mix of 
Whatever you're doing in life. Whatever we don't do now, we can do next time, right? Oh, yeah. But I was not going to be you long. You don't get to go to the Grand Bahama Island. No, this Bahia. trip was supposed to be a sea day on the fourth day. But they made, and I've never even been. I've been to different places in the Bahamas, but I've never been to Grand Bahama Island. Maybe we should go. It's but, only like thirty-five dollars a person, and the taxi from that place comes and gets you. And they take you all over to twenty the miles island, which is like, like this one, but just more like beach island with like a shack in the middle. They have like a restaurant where they serve. Conf. I think it is actually still attached to the mainland. La, 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 attached to the mainland. And so you, you know, did, uh, go out like what twenty or. How well, they give you snorkeling gear. There. You can swim out, don't you? Someone says that a really good reef is like a 20-minute swim, which I don't really... Okay, I'm afraid. I have a fear you know, of water minutes, right? in the ocean. Um, like deep water and like... I used to have nightmares about sharks when I was little. And I'll quickly tell you about this story. This is what happened on my cruise with my mom. The first time I ever went jumping into an ocean and snorkeling. It was in Bermuda. And, and they got on this catamaran that had lunch and we sailed for like an hour around the island and then out into the water. And then the ship stopped, the, little, the yacht stopped when everybody's done eating lunch. And then they let down the little stair things and then they said, they give you your snorkeling stuff. And I'm like, okay, everybody go snorkeling in the water. There's a shipwreck. I was so scared because it was deep and it was dark because it had just been rainy there. So I jumped in the water, me and my mom and maybe only a few other Could people. Did you see things like fish? No, here's what happened. I jump in the water in the and water? I'm like battling my fear. And then I noticed that no one else is getting in the water besides a few little people. And then all of a sudden, I just felt things all over me before I can even what? get my head under the water to look down to just bump into me like this. What was it? And then, I mean like everywhere, all over my legs, all over my feet. And then I put my snorkeling and I looked under and there was hundreds of fish everywhere just bumping into me. Yeah. And then, and I was screaming and screaming. Oh, if only this had been on video. Why, and then fish? I noticed, yeah, but they don't usually do that. What they did is the people on the ship deck were laughing because the guests who didn't get in the water because they were too drunk were throwing their biscuits and rolls in the water at all the snorkelers. And the fish were just like, <laughs> And I was just like oh, screaming. And the cars are on sale at this time in the Orpheum Theater on deck number five. So if you want to win some cash, you have to be in it to win it. It's big of And the water was dark and it was deep and you could see the Nothing shadow of a ship. Happened, did it? It was petrifying. Nothing actually bad happened. And it was just dangling and that is pretty much, you know, like... Well, look, you were swimming oh, with all the fish fine. and that food. I will end it like this. Me. That's true. You were swimming with all the fish and all the food and nothing happened. So it might right. be a little scary, but... It's fine. I got over my fear and I floated scary. out. And the experience was amazing because I just floated my face under. And then, and I just, and it started to drizzle. And I just floated on the waves. Just lay there without a care in the world. Water not going your and you should thing? have seen the coral and the fish. There was this water fish not going your little thing? Uh -huh. It was the most peaceful thing. Well, and there was these that? little fish that were like dark midnight blue, but they had little glitter um, silver specks. They were beautiful. So it was a very special maybe experience. You haven't done anything like that, and maybe we should. Let's decide on it more. Okay, well, we'll show you guys when we leave in here. In yeah, but see, while. the bad thing is if you do that, then that's going to be your whole day off the ship, and you'll miss like lunch and all that. Yeah, but when do you go snorkeling ever? We can go quite often, actually. We can go to good lunch at Disney. Can't go snorkeling there. Well, you can <laughs> at the water park, but not. Ah, decisions, decisions. We we'll have to wait and see. We decide. <laughs> look how neat it looks, isn't it? Why can't look? That just goes. Isn't it? Yeah, watch the island tip there on the left. It'd take forever to start, wouldn't you? And see, there it goes. See you soon with the fam. So excited to the next island. What did he say it was 68 nautical miles away to Nassau? Do you think we're going to be like just drifting? Yeah, drifting. Or else you'd be there really soon. That's weird that you drift though, isn't it? It's neat.
The seed one with cheese, please. Seed with cheese, please. Seed with cheese. <laughs> That's it. Thank you. Anything what? Oh no. Nothing. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you. Okay, so I'm excited about tonight. Aren't you? Uh huh. I'm excited about every night now. We'll this is formal night. night. You see our formal? And guess what? I'm gonna order escargot. Uh, Let me see your formal. We did not dress up. We actually had our formal wear packed, and it's really nice too. We took it right out of the suitcase. We said, "First time in our lives, we ever Because our mom loves dressing up formal night. It's always a big thing. We take hours and hours. It's a suggestion. Yeah. So we said, "You know what? We're not doing it this time." And we did. Look, we can't. It was hard. We were kind of we like embarrassed, and you know, we felt bad. We were about to leave, but we said, "No, we're doing it. We we're protesting and they said formal you night." Fine. So. All right. It's just like a suggestion for people like my mom who likes to do it. They're not gonna like kick us out. So it's formal night, and I am excited. Let's see what they have tonight that looks good. We think the Bay Scallop Gratin looks good. And the, I want to try the Lobster Bisque. And she wants to try the Escargos tonight. Yay, me! You're really going to try one? Oh, you liked it. I know, but I liked it better if it was mushrooms. Well, pretend that it's mushrooms. Look, tonight they have mushrooms on the menu, Amy. <laughs> And I think for the main meal, I'm gonna try the shrimp ravioli. We're gonna share that. We're just gonna get one of them and just both try it. And what I'm excited about is the duck. I love duck, so I'm gonna get that. And I also wanna try, she's gonna get this one and we're gonna try it together. The filet, it's like a fish. I never had a silver corvina filet. I've had lots of other kind of fish. I love fish. And she's just gonna get the um, Atlantic salmon. And I think that's gonna be it. <laughs> Tired? The days are so long and fun. It is. I can't believe it's not even six o'clock yet. We're cruising. Cruising yeah, together. Yeah, you should save it and dip in your escargot butter. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> okay, well, we'll, we'll see you guys when we get our food. Looks just like the escargot with the same little tray. It's hard with those little bay scallops. So amazingly tender and delicious. Are they really garlicky? They smell garlicky. This sauce is, this is the best scallop I've ever had. Is it? Amazing. Like a hundred, like a ten out of ten. Oh, I'm so More excited. Does it dip your bread in that stuff? Mm. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you this right now, it's gonna be so hard. I'm gonna think about the screws all the time. I was hoping you would have good food. This is the lobster bisque, with a little cream on top, I guess. I don't know if I've ever had lobster bisque, so I'm gonna try that. Can you see me trying that?
a spaghetti saucy or a shrimp sauce. I'm gonna taste a little canned like spaghetti o taste with really, really shrimp taste in the taste. I don't really you know, for, care for that or the salmon. Aw. It's okay because the covina is delicious. You see, it has artichokes in it. Can you see? It's like a thin crepe with like a cheese on it. Let's see. Three mmms. Yeah, they said if you don't like it, you can send it back. Too shrimpy, huh? It's not bad, it's good. It's simple, it has a simple taste, but yeah, it's shrimpy, it's shrimp ravioli. What's in it? Oh no. Like shrimp stuff, see? It's good, I think it's good. I think it's not like three mmms, but it's definitely good. I think it's getting the duck. I'm gonna like, I have a feeling it's all over me. Okay, I think I got to an edible piece.